Daddy, I can watch you like a big Hello and good morning everybody. It's Wednesday, but more importantly than it just being a normal Wednesday, it is potty training Wednesday. We are potty training today. Hazel is currently right now sitting on the pot. <laughs> I have a feeling we're gonna be in there a lot today. We've got things ready to go. I'll show you her chart once she's out. We've got Skittles. So every time she goes potty, she gets a Skittle. And then I've got a cute little chart for her. As soon as that's all full, she gets to pick out a treat and a toy. So I've got a Barbie downstairs for her that I might use as a as her reward or she can go to the store and pick out her own. But something that we always do after she's fully potty trained, we go on what's called the potty train. Oh yeah. We take the train and we go on a fun adventure. We do that with Brexton and every time he sees the train around, he goes, mom, that's the potty train. We are potty training to go on the potty train today. All right, so she has picked out all of her favorite underwear. She took picked out Paw Patrol. I think she has Frozen upstairs and My Little Pony, but you guys, she got these for Christmas. Uh, you might not know that was six months ago. They're a size two, three, they're a little small, but I just have to know these are not gonna last. There's, I think, eight pairs here, and they're not gonna last. Because half of them might be wet, half of them might be pooped in eventually. That's just part of potty training. But she seems super excited, she's super pumped about it, so I think it's gonna go really well. She's been really excited all week. Okay guys, this is our setup. Hazy, tell everybody what you just did. I do this, and I go poop, and then here, and yeah. Show them how it works. So sit on it, show them how it works. Just sit on it. <laughs> <laughs> that little thing is hard. We can just leave that standing up. Okay, so she sits like that, like a big girl, huh? Okay, but Hazy, you just went poop poop. What do we need to do? So I made this little chart for Hazy. It's Hazel's potty training chart. Mm -hmm. And then I put at the end, once it's all full, she gets a reward. And you pull off one of those stickers and we're gonna put it on the first square. So put it on this one right here. Okay. Good job. We need to wash hands. Okay, let's wash hands. Okay. All right. That's the hot water. Let's do cool. Okay, now wash your hands. Here's some soap. Good job. Are you so proud of yourself? You're so big. Make sure it's all rinsed off. Okay, now grab the towel right here. Dry off your hands and then guess what you get. Guess what you get? A Skittle. Okay, let's go get your Skittle. Good girl, she's got her little setup. Our no, it's okay, just leave it sitting up. Okay, let's get your Skittle. I have a big giant bowl. You can take two Skittles. Take two, one, two. Two, uh, two, three, seven, eight. Two, three, seven, eight, good. Let me see them, what colors did you choose? <gasps> Red and blue. Okay, eat them, that's just for you. <laughs> Uh-oh, I bought this a while ago. It was on clearance. I was with mom when she got this. It's such a cool thing, but look. <laughs> Are you excited? This will be your prize once your chart is all full, okay? I found it at the store, it was on clearance, and when you find things like this that are such a good, I think it was like $13 for all three, of, four of these Barbies, three of the Barbies and Olaf. And so I picked it up because I'm like, oh, you just can't find these things for that good of a deal. So I picked it up and I have been saving it. I've literally been saving this for months and knowing that I would use this for potty training. So the time has finally come, we are potty training, and right out of the gates, she pooped. Like, how awesome is that, you guys? You're gonna hear a lot about poop and underwear and a lot of really gross things in today's vlog, but it's all about potty training today, folks. When your chart is all full of stickers, we're gonna leave this right here and you can open it when your chart's all full, okay? Okay. All right, it might take a couple days, but that's okay because that's just being doing good work. Okay. Hi, Laz. Hi, Laz. I'm here with my big hazy girl. So let's talk potty training for just a minute because there's so many different ways to do this. So I've potty trained my three boys. I've heard boys are harder to potty train than girls. So the way I've always done this is I go straight to the underwear. I just put underwear on them the entire time. For naps and for bedtime, I do a pull-up. Some people use pull-ups right away all day and I'm sure that works for some people. Also, some people just let them have no underwear on the whole day and whenever they go, they go. The way I personally like to do it is I feel like if they're gonna pee their pants, it's uncomfortable to sit in wet pants. So I feel like they need to feel Feel that uncomfortableness in the pants and underwear feeling wet. So that's the reason I do the underwear. Plus they get excited about the fun characters. They think it's so fun to do all of that. So I always do a re an immediate reward right away. They always get, I remember when I did a Ryler, man, I bought all sorts of treats, like full-size packages of 
candy. And then I was like, he's going probably like 10 times a day. That's way too much sugar. So now I have learned on my fourth, finally on my fourth kid, I think I did this with cream Brex, but just one little teeny tiny candy for each one. Cause she doesn't normally get Skittles. It's a, exciting for her to be able to have a Skittle right away. So she just said, mom, I want a Skittle. Okay, well you gotta go potty again. She's just so excited to go in this diaper free bum. It's so cute. Oh, and I have an, oh, we can't show everyone. So that's just the way I do it. Some people use a specific book. Some people sing a song. I just go pretty straightforward, put the underwear on. I literally am like on house arrest for the next several days till she finally gets the hang of it. And then not only that, like I need to set my alarm every 20 minutes. She has to sit on the potty and sometimes they're going to sit on the potty and then get off and go, oh, I didn't need to go. And then they pee their pants. That's just part of potty training. It's hard. I'm hoping because she's three almost coming up here in a couple weeks, she's going to be three that she'll be pretty easy to potty train. I think she's going to do fantastic. Checking in midday here. Hazy has done phenomenal. She only had one little teeny tiny accident and she was like running as she started dribbling out. She's like, oh no, mommy, I have to go poo poo. She's calling everything poo poo since her first successful potty encounter was going poo poo, which I'm grateful for. Guys, I heard the screams from downstairs in the basement of excitement and came sprinting up to celebrate with her. It was the it coolest thing. It was so thing. cool. This is like my, probably my favorite part of the potty training is just seeing her sense of accomplishment. Like that's what I think I love most. I'm glad is how you excited love anything she about is. potty training. <laughs> I love seeing like her sense of a, a pride in herself. Like Cautious. I did it, I did it. Like Wait. she just gets so pumped. What's she doing in there? Was that the water or are you peeing? <laughs> Wait, you dump out your own potty? Yeah, it's dirty. I don't know what's going on. I'm cleaning out her potty in here. <laughs> clean. Okay, clean that. Just cleaning up. I don't think she went because her underwear are on. Here's one small silver lining blessing, whatever you want to call it, to potty training. I have successfully wiped down all of my counters, getting ready to make my favorite banana bread. But I'm just home cleaning like this area over here. Okay, that is scary. It's because she's on lockdown, people. You can't I'm on do lockdown. Anything. I'm on house arrest. I cannot go anywhere. So I'm like, I'm just cleaning this area. I've got a hall closet here I've got to clean. So we're just getting stuff done. There is a perk to this potty training extravaganza. Hazel's done phenomenal. She's had, I think, five five times that she's gone in the real potty. She's doing great. But now it's getting to be quiet time. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use a pull up for her nap time. And then as soon as she wakes up, I'm gonna put her on the potty. But I'm hoping that the success continues to the end of the day. So Hazy's away from her nap. You guys, she woke up with a dry pull up. <laughs> it's like, is this her life? Like, how is she doing this? Awesome. She kind of struggled to go down for a nap. She did not want to go. So I tried all sorts of bribing techniques and she's like, well, can I open my Barbie? Still sitting there for encouragement. You need to have your sticker chart full. So we're working on it. Do you just wake up from your nap? Yeah. And you're watching yeah. Peppa Pig on mommy's phone for a minute, huh? No, I'm watching. Oh, they're coloring. Yeah, and they're going to paint. So Hazy's taking a little break. She went potty right when she woke up, like sat down, went pee, awesome. So guys, while she's home, and I'm forced to be home, I normally run more errands and stuff, but I have to tell you, I have loved being home today. This today is making me go, okay, I need to be home more this summer because we're always out running and while that's fun, I just think I like being home more. Because I'm home, that means I cook. I guess technically this is baking. So I had some bananas that were ripe, so I decided I'm gonna make some banana bread muffins. I put everything in the recipe that it calls for. Here's the recipe, you guys. If you've been curious about my banana bread recipe, I do have it on my website. This is HowieBingham.com. My friend Amanda gave me the recipe years ago because I've tried so many times to find a good recipe. Finally found one. I'm using it today, so make sure to check that out. But I'm gonna get these in the oven and then Hazy can have a nice warm treat when she goes potty one time. on your chart? Yeah. Okay, let's put a sticker. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Okay, you got a sticker? <gasps> we have one row all filled up. Yes. Are you excited? Are you proud of yourself? Yeah. Okay, let's wash hands. Okay. Good job, beautiful. Rub them together a little longer. You are such a big girl. Done. Yeah. You did great. Now dry them off. All right, should we get a Skittle? Yeah. Here's the Skittles. I'm so proud of you. Hi, everybody. I'm going to party like a big cry. <laughs> uh, a baby? Yeah, tell them what you're going to earn. Peace, peace, yeah, I get the Skittle, I go party. I get the party and I get the sugar. Do you want to show them what you're going to get whenever you get your chart all full? Go get the Barbies and show them.
Do you want me to help you? What is this? I just want an owner. I have to open it. But when do you get to open it? Right now. Tell them, say, I get to open it when my chart's all full. I want to open my present right now. Yeah. I'm going to get this open and then my sticker all full. That's right, huh? When, you're, when your chart's all full of stickers, you get to open this, huh? Yeah. And then where are we going to go? Did you tell them where we're going to go whenever your chart's all full? Uh, yeah. Where are we going to go? We're going to open this and then my chart, uh, my, my sticker all full. And then we're going to go on the potty train, huh? Yeah. Ooh, she's so excited. Are you excited? I have to Elsa go potty train. Elsa's going potty too, huh? So what is that? I'm going to sit on the horse and go potty like. Turn around and show them. <laughs> Who is it? Pumbo and Panda. What is she doing? Just hanging out in the, the potty. Yeah, she's just hanging out in the potty, just like Hazel, huh? See, even princesses go potty. Yeah. Rapunzel's such a big girl. Do you think she's earned all of her stickers today? Uh, no. Not yet, huh? Almost. Yeah. I gotta go potty. <laughs> You guys, I was sitting here organizing my recipes and she goes, Mom, can I say hi? So say hi to everyone. Hi. Say, I'm potty training. I potty training. So the muffins are made. Now I've moved on to chocolate chip cookies. <laughs> this is bad. Dad's here. He's gonna head out to Cruise Game. I have to miss okay. today. What's up? What, are you getting your fingers in there? That is so gross. These are freshly washed hands, you guys. As you guys know, mom's been on house arrest, literally locked down. My ankle monitor keeps going off. It's been, <laughs> it's been going amazing, though. And Hazy's it really been has. Adorable. She's had two teeny, teeny accidents, but she's had so many successes. It's awesome. And I just love how psyched she gets. And even when she kind of messes up, she'll be like, I'm going boo-boo, even though it's pee. You run over there, set her down, and she's like, I did it. She goes, it's okay. It's okay. We're gonna run off, I'm gonna take care of Kruby's game, I'm gonna take the kids with me, and we may or may not come back with something <laughs> mom because she's been on house arrest this whole time she's not been able to leave the house she needs and deserves a little something something so mom hang tight we'll be back soon and we might have something for you Ooh, i'll have cookies for them oh okay there they are you guys this recipe is also on the blog this is howiebingham.com go ahead and check it out hazy how is potty training going today uh good yeah. um what are we gonna do right now i don't Doing that. We're gonna paint her nails. She asked mommy to paint her nails because she's doing pretty good, huh? Yeah. Not 100%, but it's day one, so that's what we're remembering. I think she's doing incredibly well considering she's never, oh, you gotta hold still, remember. Considering this smells like acrylic paint, like not the kind of used for nails. She's doing great, so we're just continuing it. My cookies are baking right now, and we're just having a fun day at home together, huh? Yeah. It's just fun to be home and be together, right? There you go. Let's see them. Oh, blue, I love them. They're like Anna and Elsa, like frozen, huh? Yeah, can I show them all But. <laughs> we are home, and as promised, a little special something something for Mama Mia, who's been on lockdown today. Some in and out. She's been craving this, you guys, hardcore. So we got some double double, some animal style fries. Just animal doing the in and out style. thing. Animal style. We were talking about it on the way home. Why do you think they call it animal style? Because there's no I'm animal. An animal. That's what I think it is. I think it's like, dude, there's so much stuff on that. You're an animal. Oh, you got like cheese and you're spread. An oh, you're an animal. So that's got to be animal style fries. We're gonna pig out here real quick with some in and out. And we're gonna wrap this day up. We're gonna get potty training day number one in the books. Today has been incredible. I'm so proud of our princess. And that's just what she is. She's wearing princess pajamas and everything. I'm so proud of her. She has done so awesome, huh? Purple. What? Purple. You've been incredible? Yeah. Yeah, give them everyone a thumbs up. Tell everyone, say, give this video a thumbs up. A thumbs up. A thumbs up. Give this video a thumbs up. Tomorrow we have a special opening of fan mail, so make sure to check that out. It's gonna be awesome. Go ahead and give this video a thumbs up if you think Hazel did awesome, because she rocked it. We're so thankful for you guys. Thank you for hanging out with us today, for cooking with me, and for hanging out with Hazy and giving her all the love and support. Say goodnight, everybody. Good night, everybody. Good night, you guys. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.